What if the world is on the brink of disaster and the truth behind World War III isn't what you think? Could it happen tomorrow? Will it be a global catastrophe? Let's dig into the myths that are scaring people and uncover what experts really say about the future of war. World War III Every time the news mentions it, our hearts race. We all fear the worst. But are our fears justified? Or are we falling for some of the biggest myths about what could happen? Let's break them down, and reveal the truth. Myth 1. World War III will be a nuclear apocalypse, wiping out everything. First up, the most terrifying myth of all, a nuclear apocalypse. People think that if World War III happens, the world will end in a flash nuclear bombs will drop, and that's it. Goodbye the civilization. But is that really how it will go down? Experts say no. While nuclear weapons are powerful, they are also a last resort. Every major nuclear nation knows that. Launching such a weapon would lead to their own destruction as well. It's called mutual assured destruction you fire, we fire, and everyone loses. It's a deadly game that no one wants to play. So, as scary as nukes are, they are more of a deterrent than a trigger for war. Myth 2. World War 3 will look like the wars of the past tanks, trenches, and soldiers fighting in the streets. Now, picture this, soldiers in tanks, marching through cities like we saw in the world wars of the past. But what if I told you that the next global conflict will look nothing like that, today, we don't fight with just soldiers. We fight with machines. Drones. Cyber attacks. Hackers. A new war isn't about invading countries with armies it's about hacking into power grids, crashing financial markets, or disabling a nation's military from within. The future battlefield is invisible, hiding in the digital shadows. The myth of tanks rolling through the streets? Gone. The real danger is what you can't see, that is technology. Technology has changed warfare forever. It's no longer about a few soldiers on the front line it's about the entire world connected through cyberspace. Myth 3. World War 3 will end civilization as we know it. Here's another chilling thought, World War 3 will destroy everything, our cities, our way of life. Some believe it will be the end of civilization but what does history say? We've seen the world go through terrible wars before, World War I, World War II. While they caused massive destruction, people rebuilt. Cities grew again. Economies bounced back. Experts agree though World War III could bring chaos, collapse, and massive loss, it won't destroy humanity, people have always found ways to survive and rebuild after the devastation the truth is, we're more resilient than we think. Civilization can survive, and it will rebuild, just as it always has. Myth 4. World War III will be triggered by one small mistake, like a misfired missile or an angry tweet. Ever wonder if one small mistake could set off World War III? A misfired missile. An angry tweet from a world leader. Is that how it will all start? It's easy to think that one tiny mistake could spiral into global chaos. But experts argue that wars don't happen because of accidents. It's not a tweet that starts a world war, it's years of tension, power struggles, and deep-rooted political conflicts. Misunderstandings happen, sure, but there are systems in place, like diplomacy, communication, and hotlines between leaders, to prevent a mistake from turning into a global disaster. So no, the next world war won't be a random accident. It's more complicated than that, and leaders know they must avoid such mistakes. Myth 5. World War 3 will only involve the US, Russia, and China. And finally, the big one, the next world war will only be fought between the big superpowers like the US, Russia, and China. That's what many believe, right? But here's the truth, a world war won't just be between a few countries. Today's world is more connected than ever. Small nations with strategic locations or resources might play huge roles. Countries in Europe, Africa, the Middle East, 
and even South America could be drawn into the conflict. The world is full of alliances and regional powers that could make a war even bigger than we expect. So, don't think it's just about the big three. It's about the entire world and everyone has a stake in what happens next. Conclusion. So, there you have it. The myths that scare us? They're not the truth. World War III might not be the end of the world, and it probably won't be like any war we've seen before. The future of conflict is more complex, more digital, and more unpredictable than ever. But here's the good news through diplomacy, technology, and cooperation, we still have the power to prevent it. Thanks for watching. If you want to stay informed about the future of our world, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and share this video. Let's keep the conversation going, and remember knowledge is our greatest weapon. Stay safe, and see you next time.